Shadow Zebra Herd. In today's episode of Fall Guys, we are checking out some wintry wonders in the Festive Fashion Pack. This bundle includes Jolly Tree, Ginger Bean Man, and the Festive Elf. So let's get started. So here's our festive fashion pack purchase. We're starting, of course, with the Jolly Tree. Right here, I think it's called. Yeah, the Jolly Tree, as you can see, is so adorable. It is just a Christmas tree here with a little bean star man kind of deal on the top, which I feel like is the perfect top off of this costume, making it so adorable. And we only need to get about 110 more of the presents for the gift grab event. So that should be finished in today's episode, no problem. We'll keep with the gift grab event for now, but we'll switch it up a little bit later as we continue forward. But for now, let's get going. Okay, Skyline Stumble is our first one we're going for here. We got a lot of presents to grab along the way, but for this one, I might be a little bit more focused on just qualifying. We do have new daily and weekly quests to take on. Most of them have to do with qualifying from rounds, so winning a show, getting just rounds qualified, they all count towards, you know, those extra battle pass points that we definitely need to grab. So I'll do everything I can about that. But you know, grabbing some presents on the way doesn't sound like too bad of a deal if I can manage it, but you know, how can there be presents under the, the tree if the tree doesn't get the present. So that's what we're all focused on too. All right, that's so we're running. I think we we'll, we'll wait for this to switch over. Okay, well, never mind. Didn't work out either way. There we go, there we go. Couple more presents waiting for us over this way, but we have only 28 placements that we could possibly qualify in. So we really have to move it. Okay, it's gonna switch. Got it. And then switch. Ooh, I got a little scared there, so I jumped. Ah! Okay, we're fine, we're fine. I see a lot of presents to grab over this way. So we'll hit this button to switch that over, get through like this. I don't know, maybe that was a foolish thing to do. I don't know. Uh, there we go, there we go. And then I could, I pressed the button, it didn't work. I guess I just sort of missed it. That wasn't so bad. Getting pushed forward a little bit. I don't know, come on, and then back over. That wasn't so bad. Go, go, go. Jump over that, and then I'm fine. I'm in the clear, I'm in the clear. Two people have qualified already, which isn't too much. We'll grab this next one. Ready, maybe. Move, please. Oh my goodness. Okay, it's sort of working. I'm on this one, I'm on this one. Good enough, we get a present for it, and boom, we are qualified in 14th place. So, hey, that's at least a bronze medal. Happy about that one. We are able to uh, just keep moving forward, I guess, with this, this happy little tree. Okay, so as you can see, there is a lot going on here um, with Tail Tag. We'll be able to get a ton of presents, maybe enough for us just to have a good leap towards the last of what we need. So I'm definitely gonna go for that while we can have the chance. We do have a tail. A, t a tree with a tail is pretty interesting, but ooh, gonna jump over you. I don't know if you have a tail, but I don't wanna risk it. So <laughs> I'm just trying to be careful while we can. Got a couple more presents waiting for us there, there, and there. Seems like a lot of other people are also focused on getting presents right now, because we actually haven't run into too many issues. Whoa, whoa, okay. I think there was somebody there without a tail, but they didn't really go for me, so I'm fine for now. Whoa, watch it. And then I will just try to stay up here for a little bit. Got it. This person, once again, they don't seem to mind too much whether or not they have the tail. Okay, cool. I'm sure some people are gonna try closing in on this scene, but so far we're earning up a lot of tail time, which will of course give us an extra medal if we can get a lot of it, so. Come on, come on. Got it, and there's only a few more presents waiting for us. I think that one, ah, oh, you stole it from me. Okay, it's fine, I can just steal it from this person and keep moving, I'm so sorry, but that's just how it is. Okay, yeah, we'll chill out in here for now, just for a little bit. There's one last, two last presents over there, but is it worth risking if I could just qualify from this round and just chill out here for another 20 seconds? So far, nobody seems to be bothering us, which is great. There are some people trying to close in now. Oh, no, oh, I didn't even see that you had it. Okay, or that you didn't have one. Um, Hi, sorry, gotta take that. <laughs> gonna borrow that for from you real quick, just for, you know, eight more seconds. Oh, be don't mind. Oh, they're after me though. They are after me. I'm gonna go this way because I think there was one more present right down this way and I grabbed them at the last possible moment. That's great. All right, then, so we do get a minute and 20 seconds for the tail time there. That is going to be a golden medal for us. Fantastic. Next up is Hoverboard Heroes. I feel like this is one we've been getting more and more often, which is pretty cool. Usually it's not super common, but I guess maybe in this event, this specific minigame playlist it is. Oh, look at this. Some of them have an even more snowier tree than what I have. I wonder how they get that one. Interesting. Yeah, I've not seen that too much. So that's cool to see. There's a lot of snowy trees running around to match up with, you know, my typical evergreen one. Okay, let's keep it moving here. 
We don't want to get pushed off, but we're all just chilling out, having a good time. Yeah, I've not seen that one in the shop. Maybe that's from like last year or something like that. But I'll go and grab this present if nobody minds. There you go. They were sort of trying to block me, but we are definitely getting quite a lot of presents in this round. Or in this show, I suppose. Somebody tried to make a jump for it, and then somebody else grabbed and that was just so mean. Okay, we can go, we can go. Grabbing that one. Oh, okay, I didn't realize that that would work the way it did. Ah, uh, no, no, wait, 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 don't do it, don't do it. Oh my gosh, we gotta go, we gotta move. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Dive under that. There we go, this time I did it, and we're in the clear. I can't believe I caught up, sort of. Um, there's still more to survive here, for sure, but I can get up here, no problem. And we're fine, we're fine. No, we're not, no, we're not, yes, we are, we're fine. <laughs> oh my goodness, there's so many presents waiting for us over on this side, so I wanna grab as many as we can muster. But you know what, I, I don't wanna risk anymore. We gotta go, we gotta go. Ooh, so stressful. Some people are just swimming around though. Having a good time with the taunts, but I'm not one of those people right now. I need to make sure this works for us. Okay, here's our chance, here's our chance. We need to, uh, okay. That could have could have been bad, but it worked out, it's fine. Ready? Ah, we made it! Oh, fantastic. That was so scary, but we found a way through. So it looks like at the least, you know, 11 players could qualify here. It says that, but one of them I think is gone, so it's the last one. There you go. So we went down to 10 players after this one. All right then, so we have Kraken Slam up as the final round here. If we could win this one, it would be huge for our points. Like I said before, we have a couple of uh, different quests going on right, that right now, and one of them is to win a show. So we're just gonna chuckle over here with our, our big plan to win, but oh no. Oh no, this one's about to turn. Yeah, let's move it maybe over to this yellow one. There we go. <laughs> we're just hanging out with this other tree. There we go. Hopefully we don't end up swimming here, but I guess I'll have to wait and see for that as well. But nine people need to be eliminated. So far, zero people have. So this could end up being pretty intense, but that green one's back. So that might give me some time just to sort of chill out on this one. You never know, it might just go again, but. I'm just trying to find out which one's gonna get launched next. You never really know. Oh, it's gonna be this yellow one, isn't it? Oh no, whoa, I can't tell right now. So I'm sort of in a frantic, oh gosh, a frantic situation. Um, No, it sunk! Ah, darn, I thought I had an extra moment there on that one before it did so, but I guess I didn't. It's fine, we'll get knocked out there on the last round, but it's still pretty good. As you can see, we still get 11,600 battle pass points, and even more so now that we've made it here to level 35. It's great, so Gumball Faceplate is gonna be a reward there. We almost get the level 56 too. So really working our way up with things. It's what we wanna see. But did we get enough? I guess not. We still need to get another 52 of the hidden gifts. So we'll go for another round. Maybe now is a good time to switch our character though. Maybe we'll go for one more. We'll go for one more with the Christmas tree here, the Jolly Tree, and see if we can't get the remainder of those gifts. Okay, so we're starting again with Skyline Stumble. Ooh. So I'm just trying to spy out how many presents might be floating around in the meantime. Seems like we have a lot on our plate this time, but I think we can handle it. Because I'm seeing a couple other Christmas trees around. So yeah, while we're rushing through this one, I would love to hear what are your thoughts on the Jolly Tree costume as a part of this um, festive bundle, whatever it was called. I, I forget right now. But so far, I like it a lot. We'll have to see you know, how the other costumes are, but so far, definitely a contender for one of my favorites. If not anything else, but the little star on the top being just a little fall guy is just so great. I love that. Super adorable. You know what? Yeah, we're gonna go for the fan right away because I don't see why not, considering that's just gonna knock me over. Almost guaranteed. So there's another present for us. We're trying to get 50 something of them. So to be really careful with this, but I can jump over to this side. And then we jump again. Oh, that was almost too late. Let me press this just so it stops some people up a little bit. I guess it didn't work too well. Um, but I can do this, go over here, switch to this one. Why did I do that? That didn't actually work too well. There we go. Run, run, run. And now we go. Let me jump forward. Now this is where things can get a little hectic, especially with players bumping into us, but I got that one. Then I jump over this one, and we're actually in the clear from that one pretty quick. Uh, I don't think I'll be able to get on there in time. Nope, I'll have to get the second batch of it. That's okay, only seven people have qualified so far, so we're not doing too bad. Boom, we get that 13th place and a couple of presents added to our total. Okay, so this time it is Jump Club. This could definitely be the rest that we need. So this is huge for sure. I'll grab as many of these as possible. Got it. 
Got a couple more waiting for us over this way. So gotta wait, watch out for the green peg, which is sort of way over there. So I'm just trying to make quick work of this before it gets too fast. Got a couple more, of course, there's a big crowd to race against. Got it. You gotta be careful, I'm sure there might be players who take advantage of this and try to push us off, but so far, you know, not too bad. Got it. And then just a little bit more. One person's already been eliminated. There we go, so we've gotten every present here. That's pretty good, right? Now we just have to hope that we are not the next people to be knocked out. There goes another person. Got it. But I don't think that's quite enough for the, because we got, got like probably like five or six in the previous level. So it's probably good like 20 of them there. So I think that if we could just keep going the next couple of rounds, we'll do no problem. No, you know, it'll be no problem to get them done. But I guess we'll have to wait and see. Got it. And then I'll jump over that one. I timed that awfully bad. We qualified, so that was so lucky. I thought it was gonna come way sooner than that, but you know what, it's okay. Because <laughs> somehow we made it. Okay, we get tail attacks. So we're actually getting two rounds in a row here that should give us ample amounts of presents to score. So if not, you know, last round, we definitely will be getting enough presents to complete this event in this round. So that's fantastic. I'm gonna grab that one and fall down here. I'm not even worried about the tail. We'll pick up the tail later, you know? Actually, uh, okay, no, like I thought they weren't, they weren't playing, so it's like I, I might be able to take an opportunity, but no, not this time. It's okay. We'll get over here, though. Actually, there's one down this way, too. You could also just sort of camp by some of the presents, too, and see if you can't get anybody that way, but. Oh, do you see me? You don't seem to, but I wasn't able to get you. Come on, this is my chance. I got you, I got you. So we're running over here now. I'm still not super worried about it, because there's just so many other presents to get. Got it. And back over this way a couple more. Don't know where most of the players are at the moment. I guess, you know, this is a third round tail tag opposed to a second. So there aren't as many players running around with or without tails. Feels like it's much easier to, ah! Uh, no, I tried to, I, I feel like when I somebody does that to me, that doesn't work at all. You know, like I try to grab them and it just doesn't register. <laughs> like what happened there? Hello, uh, guess they're trying to be sneaky or something? Didn't work out for them too well. I can't even see what's going on though. The camera is not helping me very much. They're right behind me. Whoa, whoa, no, 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 no. I'm running this way, I'm running this way. We only have a few seconds left. So this is where I actually wanna hold on to my tail. 10 seconds. Nobody's behind me actually. So I can, you know, go this way and said five, four, three, two, one, and we got it. So we did miss out a few presents, but nothing to be too worried about. We move on to the fourth round. So Hexagon is our final one here. Let's see if we can survive on it. Battling with a lot of people over here, of course, but we just need to find a way to the end. I feel like we have a better chance of winning this one than we do most of them. Yeah, I, I don't know why I thought I was even gonna make that jump, why I tried that to just sort of put us in a uh, perilous position, but now we're fine. A lot of players are just zooming around now. Okay, okay, that bought me maybe an extra second or two, but as you can see, there's just not worth many other places to land. It is super crowded for the time being, but I wanna steal this one so that hopefully this whole section is all mine. I might want to, uh, you know, let's be preventative here. Let's be as preventative as I can manage. Just so that I have this huge selection that they can't get to. You. See you guys. All right. And I'm trying to buy as much time as I can here because as you can see, a lot is unfolding below us and I need as much time as possible to really plan out a route. Right now, it looks like this only bought me a little bit of time. Oh man, oh man. Oh, now we're in trouble. Now we're in huge trouble. But I guess we can go back this way. We are racing against a lot of players here. I'm gonna go this way instead. And once again, only just buying yourselves a few more seconds, but we're ahead of a ton of players. So now we're a little bit more even. A lot more of them are falling. I'm going to Try to just, yeah, go this way, chill out with all this. There's other players around here, but they seem to be a little bit focused on themselves and not on me, so hopefully I'm just making the most of that, but somebody fell from above. I didn't see that there were more players above me. Now we're on the last layer, and things are super duper dangerous. Ah, uh, not gonna be enough. So we are all just like disqualified at the same time. Not quite gonna get the win here either. What a shame, but it was still a great effort. And as you can see, we do get everything we need done. So we get some battle pass points. We get the extra 100 points there for the event. We did it. So the gumball coloring is our next reward. And let's see for ourselves. We have completed this event and unlocked the Nutcracker costume right over this way. Um, yep, so we will not be equipping that just yet. That'll be its own showcase episode, I think. 
But in the meantime, we still have the second costume to showcase in today's episode, the Ginger Bean Man. So let me go and equip that real quick. So here is a very wonderful, very silly Ginger Bean Man. It is such a bulky costume, but I love it. Of course, it just looks like a gingerbread man. Not really anything to write home about in that way, but it's still just very funny. I like it a lot. So no more with the gift grab event. Maybe we can mess with some other things like the extreme sh solo show would be a lot of fun. I think it would match pretty well because we need to reach round three at any show. But more than that, I think we need to win a show still, right? That should be somewhere. Oh, I think down here we have um maybe some of these. I thought that there was one that I needed to win a show in. Win any show, I need to do that five more times. So if we could do that with some of the extreme solo shows, that would be great. Let's give it a go. Okay, so our first um, round of the show, the Skyline Stumble X. So if you don't know how the show works, if you get fallen off, if you get pushed off or you fall off or anything like that, you get fully disqualified just as if it's Slime Climb. So you really don't want to risk that. That's going to weed out a lot of the competition pretty quickly. And hopefully we're not one of them. We'll have to be very, very careful to not get knocked off. But I guess we'll have to wait and see. For right now, though, three, two, one, and we are off. Let's see if we can't get a win with the gingerbread. Now, this is a little bit scary because it's definitely, we've fallen off here many a times. I don't want that to happen this time. The, really, the best thing we can do is just try not to get hit by anything. And just like that, and dive so that we're safe. Oh my goodness. Now, this one, once again, this is something typically we're fine with, but we don't want to risk it this time. It might be better just to, oh no. Oh no, 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 no. Okay, it's fine, it's fine. Everything's totally okay. Um, oh no, come on, come on, give me a chance here, give me a chance. Then we dive over, we got it, we got it. Oh man, so t plenty of people already being knocked out here. We're gonna jump over to this, and then, uh, and then it switches, and then we just dive over anyways. So, so far, so good, this is crazy. Um, yeah, don't press that button, I don't need that one. Come on, run, run, run. Oh, we gotta press the button again, come on, guys. Now this is where things can get really scary because it typically is quite easy to get knocked off here or just get sent right back where I started, oh my goodness. There we go, there we go. So I will just jump over this. Sometimes slow and steady sort of wins the race for this one. There you go, one person's already qualified. We're not there yet, but we're getting closer and more and more people are being eliminated too though. So everybody was sort of in my way there. It sort of flew off my trajectory, but we got it. Come on, come on. Boom, we got like 13th place, not too bad. Some players are struggling and some players don't seem interested in moving forward, but that one was a lot more of a challenge for sure. Oh no, Hoverboard Heroes is the next one. They really are bringing the heat with the challenges so far. Let's see if we can keep up then. Still a good chunk of players left over. We gotta make sure we're not pushed off or anything. I mean, this one, obviously, it's sort of weird because if you get knocked off here, I'm pretty sure it counts as an elimination anyways. So actually, this one's not any different. <laughs> Now that I'm thinking about it, so, you know what, maybe it's not so stressful. Not any more stressful than it normally is, but it actually, it's adding a lot of obstacles, so maybe that's why it's an X version, is because while it's the same mini game in terms of its risks, it actually has a lot more obstacles, way more. Okay, that is definitely what the, the struggle is. Oh man, ow, gonna hit in the back of the head with a giant planet, that's not so good. One person got knocked out there, and then we wanna get off of this thing as soon as possible. There we go. So, so far, this is, Insane. Come on, come on, go, go, go. And then I will just slide down this way before that bar hits me. Oh, it knocked somebody off. So unfortunate. Come on, where's that hoverboard at? There it is, there it is. We wanna get on this thing as soon as possible. Just so we don't have to deal with all this mess. There we go. Now this thing's yeah, gonna switch over. I'm waiting for it to switch back down because that can happen. Happened to the Santa Claus right in front of us. Oh no, uh, I don't think I want that. Oh, oh, that was scary. That was really scary, but we're just gonna plop. Don't you dare. I see what you're trying to do. Watch it, buddy. Okay, we're fine though, we're fine. I just wanna wait right here, I think, for now. Just trying to dodge left and right to get through all that. We actually did pretty good, but this is the scary part. And it, it's just hard to even squeeze through that, but no, no way! Oh, come on, that was so unlucky. All right, well, that one didn't really get us too much because of that. Unfortunate, but as you can see for our show summary, we still get a little bit of progress towards our way to some kudos. It's, you know, it's something, but not what I wanted to see. Okay, we'll go for another one here with the uh, Ginger Bean Man and see if we can't make more progress. Okay, so for this attempt, we have Tundra Run X. Oh boy. A lot going on for this one, right? But honestly, there's not too many places where we could fall off as, as long as we play it safe. We're starting with a ton of players out here though. So we'll have to see what we have to survive through. But 48 players is what it starts with. 
So yeah, everybody could technically qualify from this one, but as you can see from this crowd, I don't know what the chances are of that actually happening. I don't mind being farther in the back though. Yeah, as we're getting through this one, I would love to hear, what are your thoughts on the Ginger Bean Man costume? This one is, like I said before, pretty simple, but also really funny, so I like it. But we'll just stay down this way. I think that might be safer and just more efficient in some ways. Come on, come on. Okay, that hit me, but not too bad. And we don't wanna mess with the fan here. The fan almost always knocks me off like it just did for that person and a couple more of them. So let's not risk that at all. Instead, I'm going this way. Come on, come on, go, go. Hey, don't grab, don't grab. Some person's already finished, which is pretty quick. I would like to just go this way, even if I get yeah, pushed a little bit. Now this part is where things get a little scary. I can launch, and then one more time maybe? Okay, wait, 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 no, no, you're kidding me. That is brutal. All right, well, that's not gonna work out for me. Let's try it again, I guess. I don't know, maybe we'll mix it up a little bit. We'll do a normal show because this is just not really time efficient, I suppose. I figured we'd get farther. We typically do for the extreme shows. We might try again at some other point in a different episode. But for right now, let's just do a solo show. I think a good solo show might be great to get some of the, the silliness out of our system. Okay, so it looks like we're slipping and sliding in this in this first round of this normal show. I haven't done a normal show in a while, so hopefully we can just keep up with this one. If we could win a couple of shows soon, then that'd be so big for a marathon event. But I mean, we have so much going on in this season that we're not really too worried about it, I guess. Anyways, um, so far we've gotten four of the, now five of the points scored. We need 35 of them and to be the top 24. I think we can handle that pretty well. Um, I guess we'll see in just a moment though. All right now we will dive down this way. Trying to catch up with these people sliding out of us, but that's not gonna help too much. Whoops, okay, now we're even farther behind. Got it. But as long as we can uh, take the top path, I got through that one. And I will jump and dive. Oh, almost didn't man knock that person. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, but this is how it happens sometimes. I will jump through like that. Oh no, this angle is not so good. Come on, come on. We're now at 25 points. I want that speed boost. We didn't get it at all. I think by the end of this lap, we should have enough points to qualify. Come on, come on, there it is. 33, 34, and then I guess one more on this side. So I guess the middle path might not be the best one. It looks like the side path actually have a gold one waiting for us. Either way, we're still able to qualify through the first round of the show. Okay, we got jumping around now, jumping club, whatever this one's called. I always mix it up and I'm not looking at the loading screen <laughs> whenever it loads in, so let's see. We only have nine people that need to be eliminated this time. Some people are just hanging out and dancing. And I'm seeing a lot of sort of festive themed outfits I haven't seen too much of pop up. The white snow tree, I, I've not seen that one. I don't know where that one's from. That might be just from like a previous bundle that I missed or something like that, but not quite sure. Might as well just dance with everybody though, have a good time. Okay, come on, let's back it up. Jump over that one. That wasn't so bad, right guys? Okay, that's three people out now, so that means there's six more. Oh no, I think I gotta run back. There we go. The last time I was on this, I made a huge mistake and missed time I jumped, but we got so lucky to survive. That person grabbing me really didn't help. I was, okay. <laughs> Whoops, I'm just not playing Fall Guys very well right now. That happened. So, you know, we're gonna leave the Ginger Bean Man like that and move on to the next costume, if we can muster. I was just trying to back up so I can jump over, but then somebody grabbed me and just ruined everything. Um. Uh, Let's see, that was two out of the three costumes. Next up, we have, of course, right over here, the Festive Elf. So let me equip that one and we'll take a look. So here is the Festive Elf costume. Pretty cool looking one, I love the curly hair and you know the big elf hat and all that kind of stuff. You know, pretty much what you'd expect from a Festive Elf. So there it is, glad to have it. We are just going to go for, I think, another solo show here. I don't know if I wanna match with too much else beyond that. Maybe we'll just queue them all and we'll see what we get. But whatever comes first is what we'll tackle. All right, then it looks like we actually have a duo show here. So that's pretty cool. Let's go for it then. We will just hop on this and try to stay ahead. Hopefully with the, the collaborative efforts of our duo partner, we can actually win one in today's episode. I'd be really happy about it. We just need to win some more shows for sure. You never know how it goes. You just gotta give it your best shot. Oh, I definitely wanna jump on this thing if I can. Oh, okay, never mind. And launch the other person forward. That one had launched into the side. Nope, okay. It looks like it's always to the side then. Okay, it's fine now. 
almost there, almost there, just gonna climb up this. Cause we need to be top 14 to qualify from this, which I don't know if that'll be the easiest thing, but I can maybe catch up just a little bit here and there. The person's trying to fight against it, so we got ahead of them. Come on, come on. It looks like our teammate might be behind us, so let's not go too crazy here. I don't wanna get in their way. Oh no, oh no. This isn't too bad though. Oh, the ball knocked over a couple people, maybe gets me, no, a couple plays was never mind. We get 26 points there. I don't know if it'll be enough. It really depends on our teammate here. We're currently in 12th, 13th place. We need to be top 14. So whatever points they get here really matters. Come on, 11th place, not too bad. As long as it gets us you know, on to round two, that's what matters the most to me. But I'm not sure if it'll do enough. We'll have to wait and see. Pipe Dream is round two. We were able to make it and qualify onto this one. So let's see if we can do the same now with less players, a higher requirement. It should be pretty tough, but I think we can do it, right? Me and the little ice cream. I believe in us. Okay, so yeah, that's gonna get launched up. I might just wanna wait for the one in the center. Okay, so far not bad, not bad. We'll dive through if people don't get in the way, that is. Oh no, the fans won. This one can be a bit of a problem. We need to squeeze through like that, and then almost there, almost there. Got it. There are definitely some players ahead of us here, but we'll be okay. Where are we going right now? This one is all over the place. Oh, this one is the drums, which I can definitely, I don't know, ooh, make something happen with, right? I, I'm not getting very lucky with it. That hammer was super duper in the way. Okay, this one's pretty easy, most of the time. I might, I might struggle with it this time, who knows? Yep, okay, there it goes. <laughs> Come on, run, run, run. No, no, yes, no, <laughs> there it is. Oh man, our teammate right behind us too. We need to be a, a good leader. Switch over to this side, never mind, oh my goodness. It's always so hard to tell where exactly they are. That makes sense? You know, I'm just gonna wait for the switch. Yep, there it goes. Not too many players are ahead of us though, so it's definitely possible if we can both qualify now, they're gonna take the safe route and go with the pipe. I definitely respect that one. I'm going to try for the uh, the bar. And we got it, so there goes another 26 points to our team there. So we both had a pretty solid finish, leaving us currently in first place. That is huge, so great job to our teammate there. We now have 55 points in total, even if we don't finish in first here, we just need to be top 10. That is what's gonna make us get to the third round, and all I really need to be happy. Okay, so block party is our third round here with our duo's partner. This one can go either way. As long as we don't get unlucky and disqualified, we should be fine. I guess we'll have to wait and see. But as we're trying to survive this block party, I would love to hear what are your thoughts on the festive elf costume that we have right here. This is the third one in this bundle. So now that we have seen all three of them, I guess we can sort of judge to see which one's our favorite. Somebody just fell off the side, so they're not gonna be earning up as much points as everybody else. We need to be top six, but uh, out of the three of them, we had the gingerbread, the ginger bean man, the elf, and the tree. I think the tree is still my favorite because it has the little, the little fall guy at the top as a star. Like that's a super cute. Oh no, can't go that way. But I think this is my second most favorite, and the ginger bean is the third. Not to say that any of them are bad. All three of them are actually pretty great. But I think just in general, that's that's how it lays out for me. So I'd love to hear your thoughts on them, and if you plan on getting this bundle, all that kind of cool stuff. Of course, with the time of year that it is, there's lots of cool um, festive style costumes. But after we get through with most of these, I plan on getting right back to the season three stuff. There's still a lot more to do in that. I think our next costume we need to showcase is the Ultraman one. But for now, I'm enjoying this for sure. It, it's fun to get into season. And a lot of players seem to it, it, agree and enjoy that too because I'm seeing a lot of festive costumes. Okay, we're going to jump over that one, no problem. So we're still technically tied for first here, but it is like a nine-way tie, an eight-way tie for first, which means that if either of us fall off, we are just immediately in eighth place. Which would be a huge problem. So let's try to make sure that doesn't happen. As we go up against our last set here, only a few more seconds remaining to survive. I think we can do it. I think we can handle it. People could get a little grabby here. That can lead to disaster at times, but it looks like we're fine. All right, we did it, hooray! So there we go, we won ourselves a round of block party. Ooh, we get team tail tag this time. This one can get a little messy at times, but let's see, right now I have a tail. We're starting with one, so we just need to watch out, run, 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 run. We gotta go this way. 
gonna make sure that our team has at least it doesn't need to have the most tails, but it doesn't need to have it needs to have the not least tails. Okay, my own teammate took it from me. So you better keep it. You better keep that tail. Keep it good. That's the only tail we have right now. We need to protect it at all costs. So, well that's happening. Is there anybody else running around here with tails? It looks like you don't have one. But uh you over here, you once again they're stealing it from their own teammates. It's so silly. <laughs> okay, um, I'm going down this way. And I'm gonna grab you. No, I'm not. Okay, where do you think you're going? That's mine. See ya. Okay, <laughs> so now we're, whoa, over here. Our team has two tails. But they are hot on my trail. Just trying to avoid it for now as much as possible. The red team has zero tails now. So if we can just hold on for 30 seconds and make sure that nobody gets our tail, that's the most I can do really, you know? Oh no you don't, watch out. For a second our team had three tails. But now it's back to the green team having three tails. I'm just sort of running around in circles and so far it's working for us quite well. <laughs> Whoa, how'd you get up there? Very impressive. I was gonna keep another tail for us. So we are the two tail players on our team. So I'm just trying to you know, keep safe with this. Don't you dare. Come on, five seconds remaining. We're gonna go up here. Looks a little bit safe up this way. All right, pretty cool. Wait, overtime, uh-oh. We do have the lead, but that could go south at any moment. So I'm trying to look out for who, who, not, who might be nearby. This person's trying to get that one person up there. I don't think it's possible. Come on, and got it. There we go, so we got a first place finish with that too. That's fantastic. Okay, next up is Penguin Pursuit. This one is a bit of a mess sometimes, but it looks like yeah, we're, we're split up in the teams again. This one honestly is sort of a coin toss on who actually ends up winning. Um, but for right now, I could grab this. Grab it, grab it, grab it. No, no, no. Okay, one of our teammates has got that one, so I can at least try to protect them, or maybe, you know, Help them take it away somewhere. Come on, I got it, I got it. Here we go, here we go, we're enough points. My own teammate grabbed me there and look at where it is now. I think they grabbed me, it might have been someone else. But come on, come on, come on. I almost got it, out of the way, out of the way. Don't you dare, it's all mine, it's all mine. We are fighting for last place right now. Who is gonna stay in last? Don't you dare, come on. Ah, oh, that doesn't count, doesn't work that way. Darn, okay, somebody got it, somebody got it. That's good, that's good. I'm going to grab onto all these, all these enemies as much as I can so that you can have the points. Come on, help me out here. There it is, there it is. That was good, that was good. Okay, you throw it up and then we catch it again. No, are you kidding me? There you go. No, you gotta get it, you gotta get it! Oh! That's it, that's it. So right now, yellow team is leading with a ferocity. If we could just stay ahead of the blue team now, that might change everything. So you see a blue team member over here. Got it, it's all mine, it's all mine. That's gonna help us catch up a little bit, right? Come on, got it again. Let go of me, let go of me. I got it, no, there's no way! Come on. Oh, this is it, this is it, this is all mine. That is huge, but I just, I can't keep away from them for long enough, of course, because we go a little bit slow when that happens. Whoa, that was weird. Um, I got it though, I got it. Let go of me. <laughs> Come on, I need more than like a split second with it. We are still in the, not the lead here, but we're not losing. Okay, you get it, you get it, and then I'll hold this person back, or the grab could just not work. One of those two things is surely gonna happen. Come on, come on, hold this blue player back. Oh, good job, good job. I wasn't even expecting it. Come on, yeah, just make it out of there. That was so smooth. Oh no, not you, sorry. Oh geez, they are flying everywhere right now. That one is all mine. Did I get it? No, I didn't. Oh my goodness. It looks like we got it though. We'll survive. Yellow team got so many points from all that. Wow, so we qualified in second place. All right then, so we got our, our second to last round, I think. It's gonna be a uh, fall ball. So I think I want to play backwards. Oh no. It didn't even tell me that my battery was low, was it? Okay, hold on. The worst timing ever. All right, I'm plugging it in. Hold on, I'm, I'm stumbling. Okay, is it working now? <laughs> that was the worst possible situation. No, you don't, no you don't. I'm gonna block it, there we go. You know what, it's, it's all leading to this point anyway. So we need to keep make sure our controller stays nice and plugged in, because apparently it was in low battery this whole time. I feel like it didn't even warn me, but I might have just not been looking at the perfect times every time. Okay, ready, boom, send it flying. It, it didn't sort of, it sort of worked. There we go, so our first point earned by a team, and here comes another one. Hopefully they can stay on top of it. Ah, oh, not quite gonna work there. So we, we wanna back it up. We can knock it over that way, that was good. So they're both on their side of the court. There's another one beautifully shot too. So here it comes, ready? Right over here, I'm just gonna knock it straight back in. That would be huge if it gets in. Unfortunately, it won't, but look what's happening on the other side. Ooh, we get another one. So let me run over here really, really fast, and then 
Where is it coming in? Oh, right there. Ooh, that was a little messy. So far, so good. They're gonna try to knock it over this side. I, I didn't want that to happen. Oh no, I'm the only person over here. So we need, need to play goalie. Some people getting a little carried away. That is how they can turn this game around, is if we get too overconfident, they can try to knock it in. Oh, well, we're not even over there. But okay, there we go. And three, two, one, we get the win. All right, so that should be finally moving on to our final round. I would think so. We'll have to wait and see. So a two versus two hexering will finish off today's episode. Could we win this show? It's a big if, but I think we can accomplish it. Our duo partner has been really solid. Let's go for it. So this is where we could try to play a little bit rough and try to grab other players. We'll wait for it to speed up a little bit, but I definitely don't think it's a bad idea. Okay, I'm just trying to hang out over here as much as I can. Oh no, they just fell off, so it's already a two versus one, which, you know, we'll see how it goes. Usually if I get too carried away trying to grab them, I end up just falling off myself. So we'll see what ends up happening, because like that. <laughs> oh no, wait, who won? Wait, did we win? Did we lose? Somebody else fell over. <laughs> that was so silly. Ah! <laughs> That is honestly so funny though. Okay, well it was a good effort. I got a little carried away. Let's get this one for now. But man, I think we'll leave it like that. I didn't play the best in today's episode, but at least we had a lot of fun showcasing these costumes. And I got 4,000 battle pass points there, so wow, we went all the way to round seven. That is a long show for sure. And we get the big catch nickname as a reward for getting level 57, and now we're making our way to level 58. So a lot more progress to be made there for sure, sooner or later. But that was our look at this festive um, fashion pack. The Jolly Tree, the Ginger Bean Man, and the Festive Elf. Like I asked before, let me know which one is your favorite, but hopefully soon we can do a showcase of the Nutcracker costume now that we've unlocked that for the gift grab event being completed. But for right now, that is gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Fall Guys Ultimate Knockout. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.